What's the best postseason? This is tough. This is tough. The best postseason. postseason. Best postseason in all of sports. It's baseball. Uh, baseball is the so sport good. that I grew up. It was my first love. Uh, there is nothing I love pitcher? more now. Yep. Yeah, there's figured, nothing I love more than playing just baseball catch with my sons. Um, baseball has moments that you just can't – like they're historical moments – that are greater than any. I love football. I love March Madness. Baseball has brought us the Willie Mays catch. Baseball has brought us the Derek Jeter backhanded flip in the playoffs. Baseball has brought us so many walk-offs. I mean, Joe Carter and Kirby Puckett, um, David Ortiz. Uh, I mean, just moment after moment. Roy Holiday's no-no in the World Series. Like, baseball just has these moments and that, that build up in – I don't know if there's anything greater than game seven, three, two count, bases, you know, sauce, two outs, you need a base knock to go win the game. Like that, the energy of that singular moment and the buildup of it um, and series, whatnot, I, I say it's baseball and I love football and I love March Madness. It's baseball. It, Dan, let me ask you a question. Did you, did you, did you fill out a tournament bracket this year? I did. Okay, so you you actually were one of the 22 million people that did, right? Y yes, sir. And so why bring up that 25. number? Why bring up that number? Because, huh? What you said? 25 million plus for ESPN. 25 million plus for yep. the ESPN brackets. Okay, okay, 25 million. Excuse me, I stand corrected. Okay, so Dan. It's yes, March Madness, and it's not it's not even close. It's not even close. When you talk about those one shining moments, when you talk about actually having, showing uh, people true value and what they bring to the table, right? We look at a couple of years ago, uh, Shaheen Holloway, the coach for St. Peterson, St. Peter's, right? The world was chanting his name. They went to the Elite Eight. Everybody was watching that game. Those are the moments you live for. We look at last night, Oakland upset in Kentucky. People are calling for John Calipari's job right now and asking, can he get it done and, and bringing up all type of things. These are the moments that you look for, Dan. My yard man, Amigo, filled out a damn bracket and is watching the NCAA tournament. And he has zero wait, uh, understanding. Well, can we just, can we, hold on, I just got to pause. Amigo, we, wait, Amigo. We gotta pause. Amigo. We got to pause. Your Brandy, put me on. Uh, your yard, hold up, hold up, hold up. I just got to get this. Your yard man... Your yard man, first of all, that was the term you used. Amigo? I just a <laughs> landscaper, but hold on, Molly, yeah. Molly, listen. You know Amigo. I can't yeah, pronounce it's, his it's name. A, so okay. since I've been knowing uh, him for the last few years, his name has yeah. been his name his name has been Amigo to me. And he liked that Got name. It. It's Amigo. Got it. You know amigo. what I mean? That's Got how it. we that's how we that's Got how we conversate. Okay. But again, it's called a we're landscaper. talking about March Madness, Dan, and it's it's not even close. And yes, I love watching the NBA playoffs and watching, you know, that's teams cool. go to seven game uh playing seven game series. I love watching se uh game sevens. We love watching NFL, the NFL postseason. But when it comes down to March Madness, it just brings a different tone. You know what? <clears throat> it's wrong. I actually would have said hockey oh. because anybody could win, you know, with these scores and what have you. Anybody yep. could win. And no matter what you had home, home ice advantage or whatever the case may be, you know, people think hockey, you know, you, you always got a chance in hockey. But I have to agree with Perk, Dio. It's March Madness. March Madness. I mean, they own the entire month, and everybody and their grandmama and granddaddy mm -hmm. is involved in some kind of bracket, for crying out loud. I would tell you that, that, that when you consider the NCAA tournament, which is college basketball postseason, there is no question that it's March Madness. Okay, am I no allowed point. to speak, yeah. even though I'm not a part are of this you on conversation? My, yeah. Are you on my side? No, no this, this whole conversation is just irking me. Because, first of all, Who's king? LeBron James. The NFL. <laughs> the oh, NFL is king of all sports, first of yeah. all. What is the biggest sporting event, period? The Super Bowl. The Super Bowl. It is Bowl. not even close. It's NFL playoffs. Molly. It the, is not yeah, but, but, even but, but, close. Guys, how, many, how many kids have reenacted the Willie Mays catch 
in their backyard. That happened no, in the playoffs. Uh, How many people watched not, Derek no. Jeter make yours, a run my, from shortstop back I on the flip. David Tyree catch? The Joe Carter the, home run. Dan. Yes. Dan. 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 Everyone is not playing baseball in their backyard. A lot of people are playing basketball. A lot of people are watching March Madness. I'm sorry to tell you, but I'm not sitting up here going to my son's friend's house and then the backyard playing catch with a baseball. It's just not happening. But they do have a basketball goal in their front yard. So you can't sit up here and make that statement. You're dead wrong. Mr. I'm not saying every Mr. October, like we guys got It's a good postseason. It's a good postseason. The guys got <laughs> nicknames Stephen because a, of their performance. Could you please defend me here on the NFL? Well, the reason I can't defend you, Molly, I'm not I'm not refuting what you're saying about the Super Bowl. I'm not refuting about what you're saying about the NFL clearly being the number one sport. I get that. Yeah. But there's a, we find ourselves looking forward to a lot of matchups. And I think they've been successful Good about thing. branding this sport in such a way that every week is an event. So we get that part. But because it's an event during the regular season, it's just an extension in the postseason of what we've been watching September through December because we just love our football mm -hmm. on our Sunday afternoons or our Monday evenings. But that's entirely different than the momentum swelling and elevating the astronomical proportions because the postseason arrives. That happens with college basketball and March Madness. Matter of fact, people don't even care about college basketball that much until March Madness. Until March Madness. Well, we spent all year caring about the NFL, and that would be the difference. Kurt